Oh bipolar beauty, it's my white knight's duty to wipe away your tears during your time of fear and lend you my shoulder when this world seems colder than the heart of your last lover and I would wish no other fate upon myself than to give you warmth and health. And when you need space, I'll back away with all my grace. But I'll still watch you from afar just to be ready for new scars. And if you fall into that pit, I'll catch you and pull you from it. And I would ask nothing for this. It is my nature and my bliss. At the top of the world, a galaxy unfurled. The keys to the locks on your Pandora's box. With impossible energy and limitless synergy, you cut straight to the point as you seek to anoint the world with perspective. But be more selective lest your message be lost and you mentally exhaust the people you love because they feel shoved around by the light which you've harnessed this night. But we're back to the cold and the world does seem sold. You can't do what you're told and don't want to grow old. And in spite of the joy with which last night you toyed, you are back in the void and your passion destroyed. If I only knew what I could possibly do to find my way through all this darkness to you, but you sit and you wallow in a world that is hollow, and as much as I swallow your pain, I can't follow. But the very next day, everything is okay. In fact, you had rated incredibly great. Your heart spark is a ray of delightful play. You want to go on a date, but you're suddenly irate? You're furious at me for a reason I can't see. All the seeds that I've planted now taken for granted. I won't bother to plea if it's not meant to be. You'll regret that you ranted when I leave you stranded. So I suppose it's the best that this come to an end. We must solve our own tests. Goodbye, my sweet friend.